Hey everyone, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. Welcome if you're new, welcome back if you're returning. In today's video, I am going to be checking to see how much I saved in my savings challenges for basically up until this point. So kind of doing a February closeout because some of these things I did cash stuff in January, obviously, and you know, some of it is in February. So anyway, if you're seeing how much money if you are interested in seeing how much money we have saved up so far, please be sure to stay tuned. Okie dokie. So first of all, let's get business in order. Today that I am filming this is Saturday, March 2nd, which means that my 41st birthday was yesterday, Friday, March 1st. And I just want to personally thank each and every single one of you that took the time to wish me a happy birthday. I truly, 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 truly appreciate it. I filmed my Fun Friday video in advance, so I totally, I don't even think I mentioned it in the video. <laughs> so everyone that, you know, supports my community page, like I appreciate you for commenting on that post with your well wishes. You guys are so amazing and I absolutely adore the budgeting and planning community. So thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart. I am still celebrating as many of us do in adulthood. <laughs> so I'm like, let me get this video done real quick so that I can post it on Sunday and, um, you know, I won't get too far off track. So I like to do just at the end of the month, I like to do basically where I take all of the funds that I have saved up until this point and just kind of calculate them for a record. And I will give you an updated like total on the community post as well. So stay tuned for that. Um, but for me, it's just kind of so I can see my progress throughout the year. So obviously with these things, like right now they're in the binders, but as I complete the challenges, they move over to the like my sinking funds. And then sometimes sinking funds have to get used. So money is constantly cycling kind of through, you know, the system over here but i like to just kind of keep a mental note because let's say in january i had like a total of twelve hundred dollars saved somewhere and then in february i only had like 300 like i want to know why what happened in february that made me utilize so much of the money that i had saved in january it's one of those kind of things for me so I can't really keep track of exactly, well, I guess I could, but I don't keep track of exactly what I saved in each month separately. I just don't do it that way because again, sometimes I have to pull things and then it like throws off, you know, the numbers. So anyway, long story short, <laughs> I am going to calculate this right now, although this will change. I'm waiting to see what the other girls rolled so that I can finish this off because I would like to stuff what each of them saved as well. So it's going to be a lot, but I'm here for it. But that also means that I may not be able to stuff something else next week. So I'll keep you posted. But I personally saved, I think it was 26, 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Yes. So I personally saved $26.00. And I was feeling like real extra this morning. So I grabbed <laughs> my pen from the Bridgerton box that I got from Happy Planner. And then I'm going to do, let's check the butterfly one. This should be six. Yes. Six dollars here. And this is from Frugality is Life and Sita's Budgeting Journey. Uh, I'm calling this the Valentine's Day Challenge. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. And one thing I just realized I forgot was a calculator. Let me see if it's handy. Yes, good. Um, Daisy and Donald. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Coffee. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh, I'm doing laundry, so 
<laughs> There's that. So sweater weather has 20. And then this super cute little pink pig. 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And I'm going to do some cash condensing. I like to do that off camera because I get really confused for some reason. And y'all don't need to see that. All right. So the butterfly binder has 6, plus 21, plus 16, plus 12, plus 20, plus 25. All right. $100 in the butterfly binder. Okay. Hey, Awesome. All right. And then my fun Friday binder, which has been so much fun. And thank you to everyone that has purchased this binder. Oh, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much. 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, and 22 in wings and fries. Yeah, I had like, I think two or three people purchase one yesterday. So I appreciate you. And I definitely appreciate getting sales on my birthday. Fun. 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 4. I call this one Don't Blow. <laughs> yeah, 25. And this roll and save. I have 40. Yeah, it just makes your envelopes lay better when they're condensed. So I'm definitely going to do that today. Easy Savings has 35 or this weekend. Probably not today. <laughs> Maybe today. We'll see. Fries Before Guys has 20. And we go together. 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2. All right. And I am going to very soon start working on my next Fun Friday binder. So definitely stay on the lookout for that. All right, so Fun Friday had, I can't see this. 22, it's like, for me, it's a weird angle, so hopefully you can still see. Plus 25, plus 40, plus 35, plus 20, plus 22. $164. Yay! All right. And these were both new this month. So I don't even know if I started them at the beginning of the month. I don't remember. But these were both new this month. So I'm super excited about that. Also, this was also new. So these three things are literally what I saved just in the month of February. So that's exciting. All right, let's go with the big one. My big pink binder. Oh, that reminds me. I wanted to put this here. The right place plan sends these cute little clips. And I forgot. I was going to stick, stick that one in there. Okay, so this one does not have anything because I started off with the coffee challenge. And I already transferred that back to the coffee one. So we'll put a zero in there. 2024, I think this has $48. Because I did explain that I was switching this up a bit in my last video. Come on, 20. Okay. 20, 45, oh no, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, so $54. Yeah, so this challenge was designed so each one of these will be $24, but then I realized, Brandy, your budget doesn't really allow for that. So I made each one of them six. <laughs> All right, pocket change, which is definitely my favorite challenge in this whole book. 10, 15, 16, 17. Um, I'm sorry, I also forgot to mention, this is from my shop. This is from my shop. And both of these are digital downloads and, you know, shipped if you choose. Pocket changes from M Lash Designs. Joyride is also from my challenge. 
And as you can see, I already have the envelopes kind of marked on where these funds are going to be allocated to once I'm done. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. The taco challenge is by Frugality is Life. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 200, 300, 400. Oh, I forgot because most of these challenges, like I said, I did do in January. So technically, okay, sorry about that. For some reason, my phone fell off the stand. Um, but what I was saying is technically, I could go back and look at last month to see what I saved because I'm pretty sure I rolled all of this down. So um, the piggy bank challenge is newly added. It replaced one that I completed. This flower one is from Love Always Sunny. I did complete one of the challenges. So I'm working, well, going to start working on the second one. But it has five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So, oh shoot, I messed up. Piggy bank has zero, nine. I forgot to write down this one. Yeah, my phone literally fell off the thing and it just completely threw me off. Okay, <laughs> this movie cat one is also from M. Lash Design. She sent it to me as a freebie. Apparently, I did not write this one down before the camera 10 15 20 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 okay 27 dollars whoa okay back to where we were so this is from frugality is life and we have 20 40 45 55 6 7 8 Yay. I feel like I save way more in this binder because it has like bigger challenges, which is great. And again, I've also been doing this one longer. 2035 in the panda one. And this is by the Happy Mailbox Co. The word search is from M Lash Designs. I don't think this one got any love last time. 21. The Nintendo Switch is from Allie over at Planning with Boys. She's so sweet, too. Ooh, it was a lot of ones. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 1, 2, 3, 4. Starbucks, 50, 70, 90, woohoo. Oh, that's the other challenge I was telling you about that I finished already. That's exciting. New phone I just added and the unicorn challenge, I think, was also a recent ad, but it has 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. All right, so let's add these up. See what we got. All right, so I have 54 plus 17 plus 35 plus 66 plus 27 plus 9 plus 58 plus 35 plus 21 plus 24 plus 90 plus 20. Wow! 450. Oops. $456, you guys. Oh my goodness. So $456 plus $164 plus $100 plus $26 is 
saved in two months. Two months. I have saved $746 just in savings challenges. This is not even my sinking funds. You guys, I am so excited. Ah, I'm so excited. So my goal for this year is to have $5,000 saved on my person <laughs> in my safe by the end of the year. That is the goal for me this year. To some people that may not be a lot, but for me, that would be everything. So I don't want to necessarily, like I said, if I have to use sinking funds, I have to use them, but I would love, 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 love to reach the place where I can just have the $5,000 just sitting and so that I can put it in, you know, various places. I would prefer to save $5,000 in, you know, like sinking, sinking funds challenges and other things like, or savings challenges and other things like that, that I don't necessarily have to put into sinking funds, but one thing at a time, one thing at a time. <laughs> so to be able to have $5,000 saved at the end of the year would be incredible because that would definitely help me a lot with paying off, you know, more debt and adding more money to my emergency fund and things like that. So anyway, that is it. Thank you guys so much for being here. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you can be notified every time I post a new video. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you again from the bottom of my heart. I love you all. I wish you the absolute best. Be safe, be kind, or be quiet. Be well, and I'll catch you in the next one. Thank you.